In 2020, Crypto Thrills Online Casino was the subject of many complaints from their customers. Among the issues that have been facing at this hub, players pointed out the most common ones. Delayed payments, ineffective support, vague terms of service and misleading advertisements. We wanted to get to know this casino beyond the surface level, to dig deeper and experience firsthand how this hub handles all the crucial aspects of the online gambling experience, from deposits and real money wagering on games to withdrawals. However, we were unable to cash out here, but not for the lack of trying. If you want to know how it came to that, stay tuned and keep watching to find out exactly how the testing of Crypto Thrills Online Casino went down. First, let's go over the timeline of the events. Registration of first deposit of 4 milli bitcoins made on February 25th, 2021. Second deposit of 3 milli bitcoins made on March 3rd, 2021. Withdrawal request for 2 milli bitcoins placed on March 3rd, 2021. Withdrawal reversed by the casino on March 12, 2021. Attempt and failure to meet the playthrough on the second deposit on March 12, 2021. The journey through Crypto Thrills Casino began on February 25th, when our tester Juggle Roscoe signed in and registered an account. This first step was completed without issues, and he then went on to found the account on the same day. He deposited 4 milli bitcoins successfully and proceeded to play slot games, opting for Bigfoot and Destiny Wild and The Lost Inca Gold. This is when our tester encountered his first serious obstacle. First, he had to wager in Bitcoin since there is no option to change the currency from Bitcoin to US dollars. Second, he kept losing money, and when he attempted to lower his minimum bet below 0.15 milli Bitcoin, he found that he was unable to do so. On the majority of slot gains offered by the casino, the minimum allowed coin size is 0.01 milli Bitcoin, which made the tester's minimum bet in a 15 line game 0.15 milli Bitcoin. To make matters even more difficult, the casino's TNC section 8.5 withdrawal requirements stated that all deposits must be wagered at least 10 times before any withdrawal is allowed. The high minimum bet made it very difficult, if not impossible, for our tester to play through the deposit of 4 milli bitcoins at least 10 times to meet this playthrough and qualify for withdrawals. After playing through the deposit of 4 milli bitcoins one time and ending up with a balance of 1.12 milli bitcoins, the tester decided to try and cash out. According to the casino's terms and conditions section 8.3, minimum withdrawals, a minimum transaction value of 1 milli bitcoin of currency equivalent applies to all withdrawals, including those derived from stray deposits. Withdrawals as a result of stray deposits and deposits with a match bonus carry a 1 milli bitcoin minimum. Our tester attempted to withdraw the stated minimum of 1 milli bitcoin out of curiosity to try and see what will happen, but he was notified on the cashier page that minimum withdrawal amount is 2 milli bitcoins. This information did not match terms and conditions. When contacting the live chat support in regards to the above-mentioned issue, he found the agents unhelpful and unfamiliar with the casino's rules and terms of service. They didn't seem to comprehend the issue of minimum bets and kept giving incorrect answers such as claiming that it is possible to lower the minimum bet below 0.15 milli bitcoin and even advising our tester to change devices in an attempt to solve the problem which did not help. Since the purpose of this casino test is to demonstrate the cash out process, among other elements, our tester decided to deposit again and try to qualify for the withdrawal. On March the 3rd, he deposited 3 milli bitcoins, went on to play some more, and on the same day placed a withdrawal request for 2 milli bitcoins. He confirmed with a live chat agent that the withdrawal request was received and being reviewed by the casino. Nine days later, on March the 12th, this withdrawal was reversed by the casino without any additional explanation offered to the tester. Following the reversal, our tester again attempted to meet the playthrough on the second deposit of 3 milli bitcoins, but he ultimately lost money, which marked the end of Crypto Thrills Casino test on March the 12th. Crypto Thrills Casino had a long list of offenses in the past, 
many of which were documented on our site in the Complaints Forum section. We hope that this test will provide valuable insight into the Hub's operations and business practice. Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitch and Twitter. Until I see you next time, play responsibly.